You better eat before seeing this movie or else you might get very, very hungry. Chance Meatballs 1 and 2. We're going to talk about both movies because I saw the first movie on television and then went to see the second movie in the theater. And I have to say, the first one is it's pretty good. It's not a great uh, children's film like uh, Toy Story or how to Train Your Dragon or Finding Nemo or anything like that. But it's a pretty good movie. Directed by Phil Lord and stars Bill Hader as Flint Lockwood. He's this scientist that creates this food machine that makes giant food and it goes out of control and starts making food storms <laughs> affecting the weather in his area. And we got Anna Ferris in the movie as, as a meteorologist, uh, Sam Sparks, and James Kahn is Flint's father, Tim, and you got Andy Samberg in the movie as Brent, Benjamin Bratt is in the movie as Manny, and Bruce Campbell is in the, is in this movie too, the uh, the first one as as the mayor, and Neil Patrick Harris voices the monkey Steve, and Mr. T voiced the police officer Earl Devereaux, and the movie was pretty good. I really did like the first movie, so I'm gonna give the first movie a seven out of ten, and that brings us to Cloudy Two. Claudia with Chance of Meatballs 2, directed by Cody Cameron. And this one pretty much takes up where the last one left off. And this time, Flint's machine, after he's gotten it turned off and stopped all the weather problems from it, it is now turned on again by itself and is now creating these little giant animals out of food, like a, a little strawberry with a face or a hippos, hippos that look like potato, that are made out of potatoes or pickle men, or shrimp panzees. <laughs> and there's that scene where yeah, you see a shrimp panzee fighting with Steve. And what happens is Flint and his friends are forced to leave their home and go live in California. And Flint ends up getting a job at his as Mentors Corporation, Chester V, played by William Forte. Sam Sparks also returns, Anna Ferris, James Kahn returns as Tim Lockwood, Brent also returns Andy Samberg, Benjamin Bratt, Ma voice of Manny again, Neil Patrick Harris, still the voice of Steve the Monkey. And instead of Mr. T voicing Earl Devereaux, we have this time Terry Crews voicing Earl, voicing the police officer. And Kristen Shaw voices the orangutan Barb. And this movie is very predictable. I could, I could predict what was going to happen pretty much from the beginning of the movie to the end of the movie. It was really nothing to it. And th this movie is even more childish than the first one. I, I mean, it, both of these movies... You could probably just put them on and put your kids in front of them and not and not worry too much about them. But it, honestly, it's not that good when it comes to uh, being for everybody, being for all ages, really. The jokes in the movie are pretty good, like um, piece of cake, and you see a little cake next next to a flip when he says that because he goes back to the island with his friends to try to stop the monsters since uh, Chester's scientists are not able to do it and meets up with. Uh, what's it, this giant cheeseburger that looks like a, that is a spider or taco monster. But it, it really wasn't all that great to me. I'm gonna give this movie a 6 out of 10. I do think the animation is pretty good and the 3D was pretty good too. So that's all I gotta say about Cloudy with Chance Meatballs 2.